What's up guys, today I will talk about movies that are realer than you think. So obviously every movie and TV show that you watch has some truth to it, but those movies show you truth that the elites don't want you to know, but they show it in your face just to laugh at you, you know? So I want you to look at those movies really deeply. So the first one is like, my favorite movie is The Matrix. The Matrix is basically a movie about s spiritual awakening. Every time I ask someone if they watch The Matrix, they'll say, yeah, I watched it a long time ago. But I always tell them, yo, if you watch this movie right now and you really listen to what people are saying in the movies and like put into your mind that everything that they're telling you is real like it will really change the perception you have of this world it's also my favorite movie because it literally talks about everything it, it talks about how society is controlled how like high people are asleep like bro this 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 movie is too deep it's so fucking deep it's not even a movie it's is like a documentary the second movie is avatar avatar shows you like how can i say this so i know you probably already watched the movie but if you look deeply into it you'll see that like the the blue guys i don't remember what they're called like they are living in nature and shit like the living of the land they're peaceful and shit but humans will try to take their shit you can it's also like um like a metaphor for like let's say so the the blue guys are like the the blacks black people and like the humans are like white people who took their shit and you know and also when the guy when people go into like the the like pods i don't know what it's called and they transfer the, their consciousness into the new body it's literally what happens before we go we are born like this my body is my avatar in my consciousness and that where well, my consciousness is here but my like bro this shit is fucking deep bro like i didn't really watch it like it's been some time since i watched the movie but i just like start to think about shit and it really it made me think of this movie the third movie is monster inc monster inc basically shows you how like the the freemasons are doing to like feed off our negative energy like what they do is like in monster inc like the monster go into like child's bedroom and they scare them and their fear makes energy that they use for their city that shit's deep right bro the thing is that shit is fucking real that's why a lot of crazy shit is happening in the world because the, the f fucking elites feed off our fear anger and lower vibrations number four it's men in black basically men in black shows you how the government is working with aliens so number five is i robot yeah another will smith movie right <laughs> the funny thing is will smith was supposed to be in the matrix if you don't know that so basically the movie is talking about how robots are really slaves and shit and how humans use them for slave yeah honestly i don't remember this movie but it could be a good movie to watch if you really like think about the themes that they are showing you so number six is not a movie it's like a netflix show and it's black mirror black mirror shows you how technology is destroying us and will destroy us so yeah number seven is v for vendetta the v from vendetta shows you like how a government will take over a society and like how they will enslave us and how they will like it basically shows you 
like the goal of the elites like the society you see in V for Vendetta is what they are trying to do and V the hero is trying to destroy it by creating chaos yeah number eight is also a TV show well not TV a Amazon Prime show and it's the boys the boys shows you how Hollywood is like fake as hell and everything is controlled so yeah next would be Harry Potter and Doctor Strange it's not the same shit movie but it's talk it talks about magic and shit and magic is real if you don't know that of course magic is not real and like they show you but a lot of the shit that they are doing in those movies is real but yeah of course you have to take it with a grain of salt but if you really look deep into it you can see how you it can apply into real life next movie is joker this movie is too real to be honest just watch the joker i know that you probably watched it but this movie is fucking great all right and if you are really watching the movie you can rewatch it and see how it applies to the world that we live in today the so next movie is lucy lucy shows you what as human we are truly capable of if we reach a high our highest level of consciousness in our DNA is 100% activated. Next one is a short movie is Animatrix Second Renaissance. You can find it um you, you can find it you can just type on YouTube Second Renaissance so you will find it. The movie is the short movie is in the Matrix universe and it shows you how the war between robots and humans and how this shit happened. So if you want more context for the Matrix, you can watch the short film. Next movie is They Live. They Live shows you how society is run by aliens. Next is Fight Club. Fight Club is, for me, it's an important movie if you are a man. If you are a man, you must watch Fight Club. This shit is like, bro. Not only if you're a man, you can watch it if you're a woman too, but bro, Fight Club is deep too. Fight Club is a really fucking great movie that shows you how, how, like, what we are learning. Like, Fight Club shows you how we are basically programmed to not matter. And what we are doing doesn't matter for real. It's also a little bit about spiritual awakening, if you can see it that way. Honestly, every movie that has a hero's journey talks about spiritual awakening. Next one I will go like very quickly. By Boondocks. Boondocks is a like TV show. Like if you're black, just watch Boondocks. It's, it's funny as fuck and it's true. If you want games that talk about real shit, you can you can play Assassin's Creed. Like Assassin's Creed, a deep way to look at it is like the Templars are really Freemasons. And we, the Assassins, are like us, the Chosen Ones. And it's really true that we have our ancestors' DNA within us. Another game too is uh, Detroit Beyond Human. It's like, it's a robot game. It's basically, it's inspired by iRobot. Like if you watch iRobot and you play Detroit, you will see the inspiration. Also another game is Deuce X. Another movie would be Inception. Inception talks about lucid dream basically. Oh fucking black. Yo watch Black Panther bro. I like superhero movies and like I said before you can literally watch every movie and every TV show and you will see like some deep shit that they put in movies like Black Panther. Like you see like a, a good a great society, a great like civilization run by black people and like white people that try to take like their resource, their vibranium, like their resource. It's like it's basically what happened in real life. And basically, Killmonger is right. And other movies is like X Men. I don't really like the X, X Men is good, 
but it's not good at the same time <laughs> like if you if you replace the word mutant by black people like you will see how deep the shit is and even with superman if you re if you s replace like the fact that he is a kryptonian by being black like you'll see too how the shit is deep for me superman should be black i know that he's already been established for like a hundred years but his power literally comes from the sun so it makes sense that he's black also other movies that you could watch is chronicle with michael b jordan it's like teenager that has super power powers and shit or another movie would be knowing with nicholas cage i didn't watch that movie but it talks about aliens and shit so basically every alien movie go watch that movie they put real shit in alien movies also the reason why they put shit in the movies is because if they put shit in the movies that makes you think like oh if it's in the movies there's no way that can be real right well nah so if i tell you that oh this shit is real you tell you that no what the fuck this shit is not real it's just in the movie that's more of a bonus movie it's not something you don't need to really look deep into it you just have to listen to this movie and you will know what they talk about is the secret it's a documentary that talks about the love attraction. If you really want to know about the love attraction, go watch The Secret. I think it's on Netflix. Yeah. The Yeah, I watched it. I watched it on Netflix. Also another thing that I peep in movies is they they like to make the villain right. Like you see in a lot of movies that the villain is basically right and the good guy, the hero is like wrong. Like a black panther i won't say that like killmonger is basically right so killmonger in the movie black panther was basically right the only thing he wanted to do is like to make black people great again but of course the way that it that he was doing it it was wrong because he, he was going to kill like every white people and s enslave them but he was basically right like bro you literally bro Black Panther has the most advanced civilization and he like doesn't do anything with it. He's just like chilling and shit. So yeah, in a lot of movies they like to make the villain right. So if the hero beats the villain, that means he's right. Like that's how they program you. Thank you for liking my video, subscribing to my channel, leaving a comment to show your support. It really means a lot to me, alright? And it really helps me with YouTube. Peace.